What's up guys? This is Brent with 24-7 Parts and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to change the battery on the XUV 835R. Now to start, the battery is over here on the passenger side, right behind this panel here and underneath our air filter. So what we're working to do here is to get this panel off so we can get to that battery. So first thing we're gonna do is open up the door over here on the passenger side. And then we're going to have five push clips right on the inside of this door that we need to get removed first. So these are fairly easy to remove. You can either have a tool like I have here to get these push clips to come up, or you could use such things as a flathead screwdriver, whatever works best for you. But first we need to get all five of these removed. Next, we have four screws that we need to remove. Two of those will be down here on the bottom of the panel. And then the other two are gonna be back underneath here, up right above our tire, underneath our rear fender. And once we take these loose, we can pull this panel out and off of the machine. So to remove these, we're gonna need a Torx head T40. And I've got this here on my portable impact. Now that we've got those clips and screws removed, this panel should just pull straight off. One thing that will make things easier is if you'll go ahead and take off the air filter cap here of your air filter. Once we get that pulled down and out of the way, now we can see that we have our battery exposed right over here. Once we get the battery exposed, as we see here, we have three more steps. The first is going to be getting off this battery clamp that holds this in place. So what we're gonna need here is a 10 millimeter socket and wrench. just like that. And then we will have another one of these clamps over on the back side of this battery as well, right here. So our final two steps here would be removing that clamp bolt on the back side of the battery and then pulling our clamp off of the top of this battery. Then we would remove our negative terminal here, which is also going to be a 10 millimeter socket ratchet and wrench then we would slide the battery out about halfway until we could reach our positive cable on the inside there uh, undo that and then we can fully take this battery out now i am doing this on a customer's machine here so i do not want to actually disconnect his battery so i don't happen to reset any clocks or any settings that he may have in his machine but just know the main part of this and the main struggle that people have is getting to the battery to be able to remove it. So the main part there is removing that outside panel and then removing our clamp here on top of the battery. And then the rest is normal battery work. So guys, I hope this video helped you out. I hope you liked this video. If you did, we just ask you to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. And if you happen to need any parts for your John Deere Gator, lawnmower, tractor, whatever those things may be, make sure to check us out at 247parts.com. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Hey guys, make sure to go buy your parts right here and subscribe right here.